so okay I'm just gonna give you some basics um, these basics are really for beginners in using Adobe After Effects so now um, this right here is your project window this is where you would import files to use in the composition or whatever you are creating now how to import files well it's just basic for like any Microsoft document or any Windows application we click file import click on the file okay now there's another way to import files you can basically click in the project area double click on that area and you will jump to your file folder so now to import a file you just click on the file you want and click open to import multiple files you can always drag over them and click open or if you want to import a specific file you click on the file hold on control on your keyboard and click on another file to import specific files now if you want to import an uh, entire folder say you want to import this folder we would click on the folder and click import folder right here so now that we know how to import files now this is a folder you can always create another folder by clicking on the folder icon right here and just naming it something like pictures in case you have pictures and you want to organize these so you can always drag files to that folder or you can right click click on and just click on new folder right there now to rename an item in Adobe After Effects. Once you rename the item in Adobe After Effects, it won't rename the original file. It's just the item. So you just click on the item and click the enter button on your keyboard. You just rename it to any name you want. Okay, and uh, now create or oh, to create a new composition, you just click on the composition composition bar up here and click new composition now the composition window will pop up so basically you choose your settings from right here I basically use NTSC D1 widescreen square pixels but you can always choose the settings that you want to use from there and these are some pixel aspect ratio so you can select them from right there you can select the duration of the um, of the video say so you're creating like a commercial or something or just an intro you can make it 10 seconds these are some advanced options you can name your composition if you want so now that we have created our composition oh now we can just add media to it so now how to add media you can just drag the media straight across to the composition or you can drag it to the timeline and it will add okay now how did I resize the window you can resize the window by using the um the what's it called in the middle of the key of the mouse that ball thing you roll yeah the wheel okay you can resize by dragging on one edge of the file you just imported and just resize it down now the next thing we need to do is need to know about is the time control window now for the time control window um things in after effects doesn't really play at um real time so basically how to get it to play it has to really play um uh, render it to the ram so that it can play in real time so once you click on the the, um, the ram preview right here it will start rendering and it will render a bit slow at first but once it's finished rendering you can always click on it before it's finished and it will move at the real time speed now um um so um what else now the frame rate you can always change the frame rate 
this will help in the rendering you can always choose change the resolution of what you're rendering from right here once you do that you can it will render a bit faster you can change it from right here as well to render a bit faster in real time so now how to zoom we can use the wheel in the middle of the mouse to just roll it in and roll it out or we can hold on control on the keyboard and press the plus and minus keys to zoom now the tool palette is up here we can use if you are familiar with photoshop you know these two what these tools do we have the move tool the hand tool the zoom tool the rotation tool which basically rot rotates your image um you have your shapes thing your pen tool your text brush and so forth so next is how to go full screen now the tilde key is the key right next to number one on your keyboard so anywhere your mouse is and you press that tilde key it will basically make that area full screen okay now um if you're as i said if you're familiar with photoshop you can use your space bar to move the composition around so let's say you zoom into a specific area and you want to move it around just use your composition window to move that around now um, at any time you can edit your composition settings by clicking on com composition and composition settings in here you can always change the duration to what you see fitting so okay this was just a basic introduction to Adobe After Effects I really hope it did help you so um, please subscribe to my channel okay